Yo guys, what's up? Fly here. Welcome back to the channel. So today's video, I got a little treat for y'all. This is going to be a preview of the SD KFZ 234-4. I'm just going to call it 234. Yeah. Or I could, wait, let's just make sure that, that I can say that. Because what if they're the same chassis numbers as the Puma? Oh gosh. Okay, I'll just call it the 4 one. Okay, I, I, I'm not pronouncing this. I'm not. Or we just could coin the name Pack Puma. That sounds pretty good, and I don't have to go over all those numbers and stuff. And that's what this pretty much is. It's a Puma, or at least the chassis of what we call a Puma, with a Pack 40. One of the only Pack 40s in the game. I believe the only other tank that has a Pack 40 is the Martyr 2 or Martyr 3H. And it's the exact same Pack 40. So what we can see here is that a Pack 40, I believe, has the same type of explosive ability. Um, 28.9, 17 explosive mass. Let's go and check the Panzer 4F2 round. Okay, yeah, there it is. Explosive mass, 17 grams, TNT equivalent, 28.9. So the same post pen, I guess, result, but the Pack 40 has more penetration. The Panzer 4F2 uses the KWK 40, and so we're only going to get 135 at 90 degrees at 10 meters. So if you check out what we have here, we have 17, 28.9, but 147 millimeters of penetration. Now, I haven't played this yet. I haven't experienced it. So what we're going to, the first games of today is just going to be learning what this tank has to offer and seeing how good it will fit the meta of War Thunder. Now, if we just look at the weight, it's the same weight as the Puma. 11.7 tons, which is good because what we have here is a huge gun, but no turret. If you look at the Puma, let's just go to customize. We have a smaller gun, but there's a lot more overhead to house the gun and the turret. So that's 11.7 tons, same engine horsepower, same RPMs, 90 kilometers an hour. So at 3.0, Fuck yeah! It's gonna be a great addition to my Panzer IV F2 lineup. Why? Okay, they kill me my Panzer IV F2. I come out with a faster, more powerful 75 millimeter. And if I get killed in that thing, don't worry. We got quack quack on the way. So without further ado, guys, we're gonna go ahead and get into it. If you guys want me to do more of these preview videos for the new vehicles coming from Operation Summer, let me know in the comments below. All right, guys, wish me luck. <laughs> Welcome to Corellia. What we're going to be doing is utilizing these rogues, getting up to A as fast as possible, not capping it early game, sitting and lying in ambush with this Pack 40. This, I think, is the best way to play this vehicle. Just use its speed, get into a nifty spot, and just, well, lie in wait. No one here, no one here, no one here, no one here. Good, good, good. Up we go. I saw pans or four or something over there. It was, it was, it was silver. Just kind of concerning. Oh, so it was maybe a KV-1? A Cromwell? Oh, yeah. Nice. Good riddance. Okay, let's go with the one behind. Let's just sit here just for a little bit. No worries. One down. Reloading. I love this thing. Okay, pull him back. I love this thing. Having this speed and this gun together is amazing. What a perfect setup that was. So right now, the only way I could get killed is by being pushed from the rear. However, Bravo is getting held down nicely by our team. There goes a M8. I don't think we have the time we were talking too much. Let's not reveal ourselves though, because we can just get him on the backside. It's no worry. Or unless he goes bottom left. Okay, hang on. Get us this here. Two is this. Just wait. Oh! Welcome to Poland. My bad about last game. Completely neglected that spot. I don't know what happened. But the, the good thing is that you guys got the gist of... Oh, I think he sees me. And fire one. Tango down. Ooh, I'm really surprised that we penned that. We got one more guy over here to the left. But the good thing is you guys got the gist of what this thing has to offer. Tank over here, I think. I see something in those trees. Uh, let's kind of back up a little bit more. I, I see... Okay, hang on. Let's just shoot where I see it. Oh! Oh! Captured a zone. 
Okay, I see a moving tank. It looks pretty big. Guns on target-ish. He stopped. He stopped moving. He just took. He, he just took a hit or two. KV one. Ooh, that's a quality hit. A little more in front. Okay, he's dead. Okay, someone's shooting at us. Anti-air. Now B has been compromised. I don't know where the M22 went. So let's take a little bit more cover here. I love this thing. I love it. I love it. It's just it one shots everything except. KV1, but that's, you know, we, we all knew that. No, there's another guy over here? Come on, where are you, M22? Don't be too sneaky. Okay, he's over there. Attention to the map. Attack the main point. I want to make sure no one's pushing to A. Okay, looks good. Oh, tank, 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 tank. Get the gun ready. Oh God, we we had to get that shot off quick. Another guy. Luckily, this thing does have some armor protecting the crew, and no crews poking out, so the rounds have to penetrate to kill the crew. Ooh, come on, come on, buddy, let's go. Oh, we're dead. No, okay, that's friendly shells, right? Oh shit, just hide. We don't have enough depression, I don't think. Oh, guys, we're stuck here. No, we're not. Okay, we're we're good. We're gonna go lower lower ground. Can we flank him from the backside? I don't think so. Oh fuck! Not good. Not good. You might be able to build some speed to go over this hill. Oh shit, 50 cal. Back up, back up, back up. Shit. Now how fast can he bring down that 50 cal? We're gonna try it here. Oh, no one's shooting over here at Panzer IV. I think the Panzer IV might be looking. Artillery. I think he's ready for us. Tango down. Good. Okay, let's back up to the right because there's, there's artillery coming in right for our position. We might get shot from the left, but it, it's a risk I have to take right now. Really nice reverse speed. Let's not back up into the water either. Okay, let's check forward. Got a tank. Guns ready. Sherman. Oh, off. Way off. Damn it. Good. Huge detonation. Oh, guys. I'm going to take a hit here. We got a lot of planes up. Looks like they're circling overhead, too. We need to get some bushes over our heads. Just move, just move, just move. Actually, no. Okay, they don't see me for some reason, which is a good thing. We're going to decap this, go behind the windmill. Whoa. Okay, crumble down. Oh, no planes, please. No planes. We got 10 rounds left. Looking for that anti-air. Do I hear him? I hear him. I hear him. I hear him. I don't see him yet, though. We might be able to go push him. No. We got spotted. There he is. We got spotted by a plane. Oh. Eradicated. Welcome to Advance to the Rhine. A little change of pace here. This is going to be a really risky strategy, but with this speed, you might be able to pull it off. Just bear with me here. OK, 
Okay, good, 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 good. And we're gonna sit. He just fired for some reason. Pack 40, come and clutch. Beautiful. One more. There's his tracks right there. There he comes. Nope. I think he might, he, he might see me now. Artillery up. This Sherman's playing really smart, actually. Oh, we hit, we hit, we hit something kind of direct. Ah, I don't know what to do. I mean, I could push, but two hits. There goes the house. And they and they already know I'm here. They're already seeing the kill the kill feed. They're not gonna be pushing out too much more, except that Sherman's just out in the open. Oh my gosh, look at that building just get demolished by the anti-air or the artillery strike. Can't see anything right now. Okay. Shit, back it up. We got some already inbound. Woo! A little bit more. Wait for it to pass. I mean, maybe once they kill this Stug, I don't want him to die, but if he does die, because he's already damaged, he's not firing, he's a pretty easy target. They might push up and we might be able to get two or three more kills. Oh, we got, we got, uh, Amiro on our team. He's in the same tank as I am, sweet. Okay, you just pop smoke. Just hold it down, hold it down. Anti-air popping out. Tango down. Okay, let's go ahead and push up with this Stug. Whoa, long range. Oh. And that is going to be the biggest downfall to this tank. Or armored gun, armored car. Is air power. Because if anything looks at it with a rocket or a bomb or a machine gun, you're dead. But overall, I love this thing. Hope you guys have enjoyed this video. If you guys want me to do more of these vehicles when they or just for previews, let me know in the comments below. Again, guys, have a great day. Peace out.